Do you think that you're going to have to pay, I don't know, 500 pounds for speeding, right? Now you say, no, I'm, I'm not going to pay the 500 pounds. Okay, it's prison. Do you still have the truth? Really, you didn't really say that though. Like, it, it, no, but have you not been to court? That's yeah. contradictory. Have, have we are talking about to, forgiving. Oh, oh, bro, listen, you're telling me. Forgiving. There's, there's never, Guys, what, one time, let, what, let him speak. Yeah. Don't interrupt him. Yeah. There's never, never been a time. I've been to court. There's never been time. Judge says, what is the judge? You know what? Nah, 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 I ain't doing shit. You know what? He's that or he goes to that. Either, just genuinely, he, he will just say to you, this is what it is. Suspend! I'm leaving it fine, or you're going to go to a custodial sentence. You know what I'm saying? This no. is what you're going to do. Yeah, no, I understand. Yeah. What the judge will say to you, he'll say to you, so what's your name, brother? Yassin. Yassin, Yassin, Yassin. Yassin? Yassin. Okay, Yassin. Okay, Yassin. Ah. We'll say Yassin. Yassin, wal Quran al Akim. Yassin, you've been speeding, and this is the fine. This is the fine, yeah. Deserve, yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's say 500 pounds, yes? Now, Yassin, have you got 500 pounds to, um, to, to pay the fine? Yeah. Well, do you accept that you've got to pay 500 pounds? You can say. I still don't go to prison. You can say, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You can either say, these are, these are the options you have. You can say, yes, I have 500 pounds, I want to, and I want to pay the fine. You can say, yes, I've got 500 pounds, but I don't want to pay the fine. But then the judge would then have to make a decision. Well, you've got that 500 pounds. Mm. You can pay the fine. Would you pay? And you can choose not to. But then he says that the outcome would be that you're going to have to go to prison. You're going to do some type of, am um, I a prisoner? Or you can do community service or something like that, right? So, so there are choices there. Best of luck. But, but the decision is based on what you do. Do you see the concept? So if you choose to go to, um, to, to, to prison, you can choose to go to prison if you want, or you can say, well, you know what? I'll pay the fine for myself. Yeah. Now, where the gospel comes in, where the, where the truth comes in is that, imagine the judge was your father, okay? And your father, father sees your son, he sees Yassin, what are you doing here in court? And then he says, well, hold on, Yassin, you're, you're here, but listen, okay? You deserve five to pay, because I'm a judge, I have to give you what you deserve. So you're right? just professional. But yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, he's not. Yeah, he's, he's a judge, and he's, uh, he's he's also he's also your dad as well, right? So he said, well, I don't want my son to go to court, but you don't have five hundred pounds. Guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to pay that five hundred pounds for you. And that's what the gospel that's the gospel message in a nutshell. Okay. That God Himself paid the price for your sin. You yeah. cannot simply just lie and cheat and you know sleep with different women. You know, um, is, you know, blaspheme like God's same words. Same all these things that we do. Thing hold on, let me just finish, and then we we'll go to Islam. Yes. We cannot do all these things, and God just simply turns a blind eye. What God is saying is that this punishment has to be paid. Either you pay the price, pay for that, they pay the price. Yes. No, no, no. Either you pay the price. Yes. Okay. In ju on judgment day, so you yeah. pay for your own price. That means you, you know, you, you, yeah, you exactly. go to hell. Oh, yeah, yeah. you know, because the Bible says in Romans chapter six, um, it says that the wages of sin is death. You receive death, or Jesus Christ received death on your behalf. Okay. And so this is, and, and this is, and yeah, this is essentially the concept. And so what, 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 what um, we choose as Christians, we say, do you know what? No, I chose. I don't want to pay for myself because I don't want to be separated from God forever. And so God, you know, um, allows the death of Jesus Christ to be um, jealous. Um, to, um, to, sorry. No, no. Well, yeah, exactly. He, 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 he's, he's, he, um, he's dead. Now, um, go, um, comes on my behalf. Okay. So and so and so now Jesus Christ. I lost dies you there. Sorry. I lost you at that part. I lost you there for that second. Right. So but you know he's in token or gesture or he died on or what reason? Okay. So what I'm saying is that Jesus' death now is attributed to you. Okay. okay. So rather than you receiving death, Jesus Christ's death is now on your behalf. So for example, let me give an example. Imagine, say somebody had a shotgun. And they're about to shoot you. And then me as a loving brother, Christian, okay? And I see you. And I see this, I don't want you to see <laughs> To die. And I, and I jump in the way. And the gun, yeah. and the, the shot hits me. That's, that's I jihad. I, I, yeah, I call that jihad. I, yeah, I take the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. no, no, no. Hold on. In a good way, though. Of course. Yeah, I think, yeah. like, in a way where okay. I think you, so have you, understand, you understand the concept. Okay, okay, so I, 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 I received it on your behalf. I feel you. I so, feel you. So, but, but, but you, get, you get away scot free, right? You, and that's to what a certain extent. Right. Well, yeah, well, yeah. You're not dead. 
right? I'm, I'm not dead. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah. So that's what that's what the gospel is: is that Jesus Christ received the full impact of the wrath of God for your sins. The only thing is, yeah, I get you. I just, the only thing is, I, I, what I don't like is the part where don't put me in it. The only thing it is is that why 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 do, why is Jesus and God? Um, no, who's gonna say? You might just say Jesus. Is, like, you might say. I just don't like that term. You know, you always say that okay, Jesus is God, but then if you, but Jesus is God. But then, do you get what I'm trying to say to you? Wait, before we go into that, Jesus is God, I just want to kind of clarify what I'm saying. Please. All right, yeah, go ahead. Because okay, the, the difference between what I've said and Islam is that Islam doesn't have that way out. Like, when you have, way out. in other words, when you sin, right? You ought to, if Allah is perfectly just, you must receive you, you must receive the, the um, punishment that you deserve, right? Because you, I don't know, whether you've lied or whether you've had sex with different women, yeah, for whatever yeah, it may be, okay, you must receive that the punishment. What Allah does, uh, what Allah does is say, you know, okay, well, according to Islam, so Allah just simply forgives you, he just has mercy on you. But then that compromises his justice. And so what I'm saying to you is that you don't have that concept, and so you have Allah either choosing to be merciful or choosing to be just. Whereas in um, which compromises um, who he is, essentially. Whereas when you come to Christianity, you have God, you can be both just. Don't put me in it, don't you? can be both just and also merciful. Why? Because he's just by giving you what you deserve, but also he's merciful by sending his son Jesus Christ to die sacrificially for your sins. And so he doesn't, he doesn't, um, he doesn't do away with his justice, never does he do it with mercy. But Allah either does away with his mercy, or doesn't make it just, which means it cannot be God. Do you see what I'm saying? So, so, so that's, the concept, that's, the whole, that's the whole idea and understanding. The only thing I can say is that, you know, yeah. it's going to be 40 minutes. I'm just huh? 40 minutes. 40 minutes, yeah. Yeah, just see the last bit. Last bit. Yeah, 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 that's it, that's it, yeah. yeah. That's too cool, Baba. Yeah, so we're just here, we're just talking about, you know, um, uh, a young man earlier on approached me and just asked me questions in relation to, um, you know, he's just here, he just asked me questions about his corner and, you know, if, there, if there's anything that I can, you know, give to him or say to him that he can go up and, you know, go away and, and, and look at and you know, to cut, you know, to have something to, to ponder on. And I just gave him the gospel, yeah. but then we had some Muslims approach and they were kind of um, thrown in there, you know, they, they're, they're a bit to it. But what essentially I was saying to him is that, listen, the bottom line is the gospel news. The gospel news is that we are all sinners. We are all broken people. We are damaged goods. And because of our choice, we've chosen to sin against the Holy God. And what God did is he sent his son, Jesus Christ, Amen. as a sacri uh, sacrificial atonement to die on the cross for our sins. Now the thing is this, when the Muslims ask, wait, does that mean that we can just go away scot free? No, it's a choice. You, choose, you either choose to accept and to accept Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior and accept that he and um, uh, 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 allow God to put in his, his death onto your account so that you can, go, you can walk away free or you reject him and then you die in your sins. So the, 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 the bottom line is that God is just but he's also merciful. And through, his, through Jesus Christ's sacrifice that you can serve.